Ancient Warrior, welcome back to Prepping in Free America. If you like what you hear here, hit the subscribe button. I guess you can, by the way I'm dressed, tell it's pretty cold around here the last few days. <clears throat> if you follow football like I do, I'm not real good at it, but I do follow it a little, minutely. Uh, always at playoff time. Never this, you know, I'm not a football fan anymore. I guess you all know that DeMar uh, Hamlin took a hit during the Bills game, got up, took a couple of steps and collapsed with a massive, massive heart attack. And I think he's 24, 25 years old. He's very, very young for that to happen. What you may or may not know, on Friday, a former player of the Jacksonville Jaguars was found dead. He's 38. They suspect a massive coronary. What's going on, folks? They're starting to put two and two together, and it's not looking good. Over in Europe and in South America, they've had They've had soccer players collapse and die. They're contributing this to possible side effects from the jab. Folks, if you've taken the jab and you even feel remotely funny Please go visit your doctor. Have them run a few tests. Make sure you're okay. Make sure everything's okay. And I mean, if you feel even the, the minorest lightheadedness, go to the doctor. Go to an emergency room. Tell them, hey, I'm not feeling good. I'm lightheaded. Especially if one, if your arms are hurt, or you've got a pain in your arm, or your arm goes numb. My prayers go out to Damar Hamlin's family, because from what I'm seeing and reading, they don't expect him to recover. You know, they've got him on oxygen. Forced, he's being forced br to breathe. They said he's not brain dead yet, but he's not breathing on his own either. Please, folks, if you've taken the jab and you even remotely feel funny, please go see your doctor. I'm not blaming the jab, but also at the same time, I'm looking at some things that I'm, I know of. <coughs> With that being said, I'm the Ancient Warrior. Be blessed, love your families, hug them close, and know it's better to have this stuff and not need it than need it and not have it. We're out.